for being here uh, tonight. It's I, everybody's got a lot on their plate and uh, lots of lots of busy scheduling going on all the time. So the fact that you took time to be with us is just awesome. I'm delighted to uh, share the stage with this gentleman who cooked with me at Regis many years ago. I'm, I'm just your sidekick, that's it. Okay. I'm here because I drink a lot of wine, and your wine is just amazing. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you so much. And I really want to introduce all of you to the, to the new wine. It's, um, it's doing really well. We're rolling it out all around the country. And um, people are just loving it. I mean, it's, it, oh my gosh, I've done everything in this world but porn, and, you know? But, but I, I've never been in the wine business, and it is the most fun business, isn't it? It is. It is. All of our um, wines are made in um, Monterey County. Oh, and you came to see Scandalous. Yeah, that's a business I don't think I'll ever go back to. Broadway. That killed me. But anyway, we have a Chardonnay and we have a Red Blend. And um, uh, the, the Chardonnay is very different from the Chardonnays that become sort of prevalent. You know, the California ones, you know, that are so oaky. So buttery, and and this one, I said, if you guys can make it, the Shy Family Wineries, if you all can make a Chardonnay that's that's like when I first went out to California in the 1970s to pursue my career, they were light and delicate and. This is so this is so beautiful, Kathy. It has a cleanness that you don't find in a lot of California Chardonnay. But that's that Monterey fruit. Yes, yes. I, I discovered the reason that Monterey is such a great place to grow wines for rape. Great. It's because there's hang time. It's right near Carmel, and this mist comes in, and it's just beautiful there, and it's just like the perfect conditions to grow grapes. So I'm going back again next month. <laughs> so anyway, are you liking it, everybody? Yes. Yes. Hoda yes. says to send her love. She was going to come tonight until she found out it was Bloomingdale's Westchester, not Bloomingdale's. Yeah, I know, but she lives in the city, and so. Anyway, she sends her love to everybody. So, what are we going to do now, Peter? So, we're going to cook a little bit. Okay. So, we're going to make something that will pair great with this Chardonnay. Okay. Which is a fennel dusted shrimp served on a zucchini pancake with a pink grapefruit glaze. Don't you love it when he's all dirty? Okay, let's do it. <laughs> 